talk about the beta gain or HFE of a transistor. It's all the same thing. We're talking about bipolar junction transistors, BJTs. This bipolar just refers to the fact that they use both the electrons and holes. Uh, that's a bipolar part of it. And this HFE, you'll see that on the data sheets. And that's just your gain. It's a hybrid parameter, forward current gain. Uh, most of the time I refer to it as beta now. Uh, it's a DC gain. And we measure it. Uh, with this formula here, it's the uh, current from the collector to the emitter divided by the current from the base to the emitter. Now, we made up this little uh, circuit here. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to try to put 10 microamps uh, from the base to the emitter. So I'm using a 1 meg resistor. And at 10 volts, that's going to give me, uh, you know, 10, uh, 10 microamps. But I'm I'm dropping uh, 0.7 volts across this uh, junction here, so I'm going to put in 10.7 volts into this unit here, and that should give me my 10 uh, microamps through the uh, through the emitter here. And then I'm going to press this switch down here, and I'm going to put voltage into the uh, collector here, and then I'm going to measure the current from the collector to the emitter through here. Uh, this 20 ohm resistor, uh, you can leave that out. That's just uh, little bit of protection there for the from the inrush current but I've got a set up right here put my meter on uh, microamps and I have uh, well, 10 all right so I've got 10 microamps and if I can we see that yeah Let's see. 10 microamps if I depress the button here I've got uh, 2,000 uh, and 50 2060 so that means I have the gain on this transistor is going to be 206 divided by 10. This is a uh, 2N222 I've got another one here we'll try that one 10 milliamps this has to be about uh, 208 pretty close this one's a, uh, a 2N3906. Uh, 10 microamps. And that's going to be 100 and say 185, uh, the gain on that one. Now this one's a uh, 13001. And they don't have much gain. Now they the uh, <clears throat> the way they're set up is different. The base and the emitter are different. So uh, on this one here, the uh, the base is on number three. So I've got it changed around here a little bit. I'll put that in there. Let me move this uh, over to here. And ten uh, microamps again. But now I've only got uh, 214 divided, so that's going to be 21, 21.4. So the gain on this one is only about 21. So, and that is true with the uh, spec sheet there if you look them up. So, uh, yeah, thing works pretty good. Just a simple way to check gain on the transistor. Um, if you start with your 10 microamps, then it makes the math easy to divide it out. And uh, that's it. Uh, thank you.